Why hello YouTube, this is King David and I'm here to show you a new tutorial on how to install MC My Admin on your very own Linux VPS like always. Uh operating choice, I mean operating system of choice is CentOS uh five point six, I think it's at right now. Anyway, so you're going to need this is a definite need for installing MC My Admin on your VPS. You need, need, need a sixty four bit operating system. Now, I'm going to make this extremely easy for everyone, and the way I'm going to do that is I have written up an SH script. Now, what some people, some most people don't know what an SH, SH script is, but basically it is an executable file for Linux, just like an EXE for Windows. So I have written this SH script up for everyone. It doesn't completely work, but I'm going to show you how to work with it in this video. Um, some quick precautions before we go through this. Um, it takes a long time to install MC My Admin. Long time meaning probably about 30 minutes, mainly because Mono has to be installed. And what Mono is, Mono is basically for Linux to be able to run .NET programs for Windows. What .NET is is basically a language for programs on Windows. Um, so you're going to need that for your Linux server, so it can run the MC My Admin program. So we're going to start out with a couple commands which will of course be in the description. So first we're going to want to go wget http mymcserve.com slash mcmyadmin.sh Now you want to go like this sh no oops shmod 777 mc my at ooh my admin oh I spelled it wrong great myadmin.sh. So now, what we just did is it's now executable. We can run it. Yay, yay, yay. Now, you all you have to do is just do sh my mc, oh, mc my admin. Why am I having such trouble with this? .sh. So you do sh mc my admin .sh, Press enter. And look at this. Do, 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 do. And it's going to run through a series of installs setups and it's gonna ask you this you just say yes it's gonna download all of that and basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause this video until it's done so you'll see me when mono is finished or close to being done okay and I'm back and it just finished uh, downloading the my MC uh, MC my admin files and installing the extensions needed so now it is downloading the mono file um, mono it takes forever to install because it has to do so many things the downloads quite large but anyway uh, I'm just gonna have it run through but first I'm gonna say a couple things I'm looking for requests for tutorial so if you would like a tutorial done by me which I know just about everything when it comes to Linux and Minecraft and just Linux just leave a comment private message me whatever and I will certainly love to make that tutorial. But anyway, I'm just going to let this run through. Maybe put some music, who knows. And it's going to be speeded up on your screen.
Alright, and now Mono is finally done being installed. That probably took about, well, let's take a look, 30, uh, probably took about 25 minutes. You will be presented with this screen and just press Control X. It will take you out of there. So now we're here. Yeah, go like this. Okay. So now what we're going to need to do is you type screen mono MC my. You have, this is very case sensitive, so you have to type it just how it's supposed to be admin.exe so what this is doing it's starting up the server and the reason why you need to do that is so now that it's started up you can go on the internet browser so you press plus for a new tab of course uh, take the IP of the server and you just do 8080 and it says access denied and the reason for this is you need remote connections are not permitted when using the default password so the way we get around this is we do once we're in here now you have to do this step that's why I showed you you have to do slash quit so it takes you out of there now you're going to want to type in nano mc now the reason why we went and did that is because once you run it for the first time it makes the config file so now that we have done that we just do nano mc myadmin dot conf so nano is the notepad of Linux of course so well, you're going to have to do a couple of things in here. What you're going to want to do first is just scroll down and you'll see memory. Now memory is whatever uh, amount of resources your VPS has. This one I'm currently using only has 512. So what you do is you just type 512 and we keep going down. Um, now this is the part we need right here. Password MD5. You're going to need the MT5 hash of the password of your own choice. So, first, let's just backspace all of this. And now, you're going to just want to go into your browser, go to google.com, and, you know, just type in MD5 hash gen. And this is the website you'll get. I'll have this link in the description. And, you know what, let's make this password sharks with an exclamation point. You just type that in, you press MD5, there you go, you have it. You go back onto here. And the way to paste on Linux, all you do is just press right on the right uh, click on your mouse. So you just press right click, and bam, look, there it is. And now we are done in here. All you need to do is Control X, yes, and then enter. So now we're here, and we just do once again screen mono MC my admin. Dot exe. And there we go, it's now starting up. We go here, it's going to ask us for the ad password. Sharks, okay. And here we go. You're going to want to go through the wizard, and let's name it YouTube, yay. And I just like to press start. Do, 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 da, da, do, do. All right, and a lot of times your browser will go not responding, and the reason for that is is MC Miami is very browser intensive, so you just gotta wait that out. Uh, I'm gonna pause this video until my browser stops being dumb. Oh, and look at that, it's back. I didn't have to pause it. Okay, just press continue. You don't want to pause that. Okay, so let it keep running. And the larger the VPS you have, you won't have this. Um, so, do, 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 do. let's just press continue again, and you know it's just going to keep saying the same thing. But anyway, you can see on your screen over here, it's actually preparing the spawn area and everything. So, nothing to worry about. So, let's just wait for this to load up. Only eight, eight, eight players are permitted when using MC My Admin Personal, and that's because we don't have a license key. So it's starting back up again. Let's minimize this. Okay, so now it's loaded up, and just to test to see that it works, let's go on to Minecraft, log in. Let's put in the IP. connect and look at that we're in now oh, look it's all icy and stuff that's cool 
And look at that, we now have a Minecraft server on MC Miami, and it works. So let's go on the browser and see it now. Only if it was unresponsive. I'm going to pause this until my browser's. Alright, and we're back, and you see you have your RAM usage displayed, your CPU usage. Uh, you especially like this chat window right here, you know, you can right click people if they're actually online, your users and your groups. You know, you got it all. Anyway, this has been. Oh, wait! Let me show you this real quick. How to add your license key in. Um, uh, if I'm not mistaken, okay. So you just press here, updates, enter license key, and voila, you add your license key. So this has been King David. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial on how to install MC My Admin. If you have any questions, just leave a comment, and I will answer them as soon as possible. Anyway, thanks for watching.